Yo, what's up, sexy Samlander squad? Today we're here doing a ranked one versus one. Now, yesterday's comments were all about the game, which is nice. It's actually really cool. I just don't know what to play now. Uh, a lot of the comments were actually bashing me for camping under Phoenix, uh, or not using my fire stance a lot, or me saying that going bracer on hell was stupid or a lot of things and um you know everybody's entitled to their opinions right <clears throat> Real, all right. that being said some things are not opinions some things are facts like if i'm going to go 100 percent anti-heal why would you get more healing aka bracer that's a fact. You definitely should not go like that. Um, but he did, you know. Another thing is... Uh, like, for instance, right now, I'm 100% he's going to go Toxic Blade. 100% because I'm Zongkui, I have the 1-3 combo, and I'm going Bracer. Or, and I'm going um, Bancrofts. So what I'm not going to do is go Bracer and make his anti-heal even better. I don't know why that would be stupid. People were saying I was I was BMing Andinster, saying that, that I did that, or that Bracer was stupid. I wasn't BMing him. He made the wrong call. It's not BM to say that someone made the wrong call. So, I don't know. Um, what else? I don't know. Nice. I was not expecting him to be able to do that that quick. That was really nice. I wonder if he put two points in, uh... No, he definitely did not. Ah, uh, maybe he did, actually, because he leveled up there. I don't know. I'm going auto-attack Zonkwe, by the way. I did this on stream. Um... Two days ago, I want to say maybe three days ago. I, I'm not actually sure. I did this this build on stream uh, via a donation request. I was so disappointed. I was like, I was I was gonna lose the game, you know? Like, there was no chance in hell. I was just getting obliterated, hands down. No chance in hell I was gonna win. Uh, and then I killed him three times in a row, and I won. So you know, maybe with a little tweaking to his build because he gave me a build. He told me. I had to go uh, Hunter's Blessing, Demonic, Telekines, um, and then Bancroft's, you know, like Bancroft's third item. And I was like, oh god damn it, I'm gonna lose the game, I can't get Bancroft's, you know, I'm a mage with no Bancroft's and they, they lose, right? But Well, I did, I mean, I, I lost for about 20 minutes, and then I came back after I had all of my build. Um, but I'm going to tweak his build a little bit and see if we can do well all game with an auto attack Zong build. The only difference is that I'm not going to be super completely auto attack from the very, very start of the game. You know, like, um, like I would be if I was playing that match. Because I'm starting, I am starting with Hunter's Blessing. But um, I'm not starting into Telekines, I'm starting into Bancrofts. So. For the early game, I'll be ability based still. And for the late game, I'll be auto attack based. You might be wondering, Sam, how do you plan on beating an Arachne? Arguably one of the best auto attack assassins, as auto attacks on Quake. And I'll tell you, friends. Um, pretty much just because I do plan on it. That's that's about it. I want to, so I'm gonna make it happen. That's about it. Say it, mean it, do it type shit, you know? Anyone remember that? That's from a while ago. But yeah, regardless of uh, <clears throat> just a couple of comments that I commented on, not commented on in, in the video, but it, you know, right now I talked about, um, the comments were really, really positive, and I just wanted to say thank you for it. I mean, like, you guys have been killing it with the support recently. The video's getting like, 
13, 14k in 24 hours. Really, really nice. Um, I don't know. Y'all have just been doing an awesome, an awesome thing for me, and I appreciate it a lot. You guys have been uh, really, really killing it for me. Unfortunately, he is a quick spider. Spiders would have been annoying. I probably couldn't have gotten past them. But that's alright. We can get red buff for free. Unless he ults it, which would uh, would kill him. I'm pretty sure he doesn't want to kill himself for red buff. I mean a lot of a lot of smite players do. Don't get me wrong. A lot of smite players kill themselves for red buffs, me included. Uh, but I don't think he wants to because he's smarter than I am. And his name is Buster Big Loads, so. He's clearly got the more superior advanced mind than me, so I don't want to, I don't want to, uh, what is the word? What is the word I'm thinking, or the phrase? I'm not belittle. I'm not belittling him. I don't want to, like, you know where you, oh, underestimate. That's the word. I don't want to underestimate him. Because frackney has got... Pretty strong early game, or not early game, but uh, the fighting potential all game. Obviously, he sacrificed a little bit of it for Golden Blade, and by a little bit of it, I mean pretty much all of it. But he has a bad early game, anyways. Arachne does. I don't know if people are in the comments. Sim just said Arachne was a good early game. No, I misspoke. She doesn't have a girl early game. Arachne has a bad early game. Um. And he sacrificed what early game he did have in order to get clear, which I think personally is a mistake. I let him heal off me because I am the big dumb. Aw, uh, that was a really quick ult. Nice ult. Nice ult, buddy. I don't have my Hunter's Blessing all the way stacked yet. I was actually going to do some damage to the tower, but I don't think I need to win early. And if I win too fast, then I won't have my auto attack build online. So let's not win. Let's not push that tower down. And let's keep playing. And we'll go, uh... We'll go Telekines next. He's got that Hasten, my boy. How much damage do I do for auto? Well, 37 with the other one. 73 with that. A little over 100 damage per auto. Ah. <laughs> He's pretty good at running, man. Pretty good at running. That's all right. We'll get him eventually. Eventually. We got the Hunter's Blessing stack, so now we're doing even more damage per auto with faster attack speed. Go ahead and just clear these boys. How much is that doing on the on the secondary hit? Did I see 96? There's no way it's doing 96. What's the secondary hit do? 50%. I'm not doing 200 per auto, so I, it's definitely not doing 96. I don't know what it actually was doing. 38 there and 75. That's not bad, man. To be honest with you, that is not bad. That's over 100 damage per auto. Easy. Fuck. Oh, he ulted. Alright. That's okay. That's alright. Don't fret, my young ones. All right, you know, I can't complain. We out traded him. I'll beat his ass with some autos. Just kidding, spiders are tanky as hell. We'll take the tower. We're gonna beat his ass some more. Oh God, I almost threw. Oh my God, I almost threw the kill, dude. 
That's so close. He's gonna surrender, isn't he? I don't know, man. Maybe Buster Big Loads. Not only does he have a big load, but he's got a big fucking sack, and he won't surrender. So we'll see. I hope, man. I hope he doesn't surrender. Hope he lets me live out my fantasies as auto attack Zong Quay. Can we get Telekine? Dude, that shit is expensive. That's expensive. What's the. 30% attack speed, 30% attack speed, 20% attack. Let's just go Toxic, man. Like, it's not gonna be bad. Well, let's get beads too. It's not gonna be bad because it's anti heal and we need anti heal because he has bracer and his one. Um, that being said, I'm pretty sure I can out damage the anti heal, but why do I have, or out damage the life steal, not the anti heal, but why do I have to out damage the life steal if I could just get anti heal, you know? I will beat your ass! Oof. Boy, oh boy, was that close. I could get Phoenix, probably, but I want to see if I can beat Bull Demon's ass. Wait, I'm actually fragging this boy? But can I do it without dying, is the question? Oh my god. Okay. I mean... Okay, <laughs> I wasn't expecting to be able to actually do that, but I guess I can. Hey, <laughs> let's get into it then, man. Hell yeah. The auto attack Zonger Donger. I need some pen, which is why I'm going demonic right now. Whoa! My big old boy. Yo, can I get frostbound, dude? That'd be sick. Damn it. He has Ganges. He's so quick. I'm, I'm beating this boy's butthole, dude. He all did. Okay. Don't land on me. Oh, he's just running away. I don't know why he would turn back in and try to fight. I don't know why he would do that. Don't stop. Don't do it. Alright. Um, so, again, I could go get his Phoenix, but I want to live out my fantasies as auto attacks on Quay. So, we're going to keep playing the game until he surrenders, I think. You know, though, uh, there's two comments that have really been catching my eye recently. One of them is auto attack on Quay. And the other one is play out Pwash, but force them to surrender. You can't kill the Titan. They have to surrender the game. Right? What if I combined them? What if I force him to surrender with auto attack Zong Kui? Is that even more the meme? Oh, the auto. Okay, let's go get Telekines. Now we're getting freaky. I need 2100 gold. How do I get 2100 gold without killing him? Because if I kill him, he surrenders. And how do I get 2100 gold without sitting in wave doing this? For 48 minutes farming waves. Uh, the answer is I don't know. If I do the Phoenix, he will surrender, right? Because fire minions and arachne don't mix well. He does have golden bow. So you know what? I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. He won't surrender. Oh my god, dude. We got his bracer there. 
By the way, auto attack Zog, if you haven't noticed, will drop your objectives. I'm gonna beat your ass with autos, my boy! Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, that's what you thought. You thought I wasn't gonna. No abilities, just auto attacks, out trading the Arachne. I mean, I did beat, though. So. But he, I mean, he shelled. Right? It evens out. Beats for shell, probably. Um, How much do I need? 2100? Let's do Bull Demon. This is annoying. He's not going to stop me, right? Like, he won't come over here. Oh my god, he scared the shit out of me. He came over here. You need to ult. You, you need to ult. You need to ult? Okay. I mean, the game would end right now, but because this guy refuses to hit his F6 button, I can't. I mean, I can't kill the Titan, right? I gotta win by surrender. I'm gonna sit here and just keep building auto attacks on Quay until I win the game by surrender. I have to mix the two comments. Now that I have Telekines. I feel like I've finally fulfilled my purpose as auto attack Zonque. By the way, I don't know if you guys just saw that. Telekines procs two times. Look. One auto, two Telekines procs. So, uh, quite the numbies. Quite the numbies I'm doing right now. I can actually just beat this guy's ass with no abilities at all. Like what you're doing right now is forcing your ult. You want to force your own ult? Look at that. Look at this. Oh my. Four. Four autos. Four autos so far. I'm slowing him. Damn. Yo, am I scared of him? I'm not scared of this boy at all, dude. Let's go. Let's go. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up, dude? What's up? Hey! The win by surrender as auto attack song. That's how we do it. Hell yeah, dude. Yo, if y'all enjoyed that video, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Check out the merch below. Hit the notification bell on the YouTube video. Check out the Twitch channel, twitch.tv. Hit it with the GG and peace.